hey friends welcome to all of you this video is especially for people uh, who have been feeling anxiety nervousness for whatever reason maybe for a short while long while uh, having panic attacks right or any kind of emotional pain or any kind of physical pain in the body for which there isn't any kind of physical cause if you have any kind of problems like this let me assure you it's a very common thing and in this video probably i will be able to give you some insight and some direction about maybe how you can solve it there are no promises but i am going to share you something uh, and you let me know in the comments uh, how was it did it help you uh and if you probably have already experienced what i am going to talk about so recently a friend of a relative reached out to me for energy healing uh they wanted to learn about reiki and i was very excited uh that because i am a reiki master and spreading energy healings especially reiki is one of the parts of the purpose of what i do right so when someone themselves approach me for learning reiki i was excited and then i got them on a call to discuss why they wanted to uh, learn it and if they have any questions so we discuss we had a small discussion and i understood their reasons uh and i felt very happy during the call okay and then we decided upon the day and we bid goodbye till then during the call before the call i was very happy excited uh but after the call once i had committed that okay i will give you the attunement for reiki anxiety started creeping in okay maybe it's like performance anxiety nervousness uh the way we have anxiety when we want to give a speech or maybe we want to record a video like this or we want to go for an exam or if we are seeing someone maybe dating someone or going for a job interview right so maybe it's about that i am not sure uh and i felt okay i call myself a reiki channel a pranic healer a hypnosis guy neuro linguistic programming guy right <laughs> i believe that i am very smart because of my ac- academic background right i also say that i am an empath i understand people's problems but can i really solve my own problems right because if i am an energy channel if i am a light worker and if i have just promised someone to teach them reiki i myself am feeling very anxious right now so like there's there's a there's a gap in between right if i cannot solve my own problems how can i solve theirs and this has been a very common phenomenon with me whenever i try to help people they come back with very beautiful results i have lot of testimonials uh varying from very simple things like headaches to as complicated things as arthritis right uh and very interesting stories but often times when it comes to committing to it and doing it uh there's a lot of pain that i have to always go through okay not always but often and even this time the same thing was happening and i had been researching a lot on this and i had realized this and this may be what is going to be helpful to you okay if you feel anxiety for no reason especially after committing to do something or when you have a place where you need to perform comes to you how can you overcome that anxiety and actually do good so i understand that this anxiety comes because of the 
dual nature of the mind in which it gets stuck up when you're thinking about performing and giving results you are stuck up between the two opposite things that is whether you would be able to deliver or you won't be able to deliver whether you will remember everything for the upcoming exam or you won't whether you will crack the college exam or you won't whether the person you are going to meet for the date is going to like you or not right and what happens worse is the ang- this is a first level anxiety which comes up the second level of anxiety also begins to come up in which you become fearful about you become anxious about this anxiety also that is oh god i have this anxiety right right now will this go or not so there was already a dual thing in which the mind was already caught up in and now there's another dual thing which has come up right anxiety about the dual thing and it forms a vicious cycle and because of this your performance goes terribly bad right often the performance goes terribly bad and it gives you further anxiety right it makes you lose confidence about yourself this has been happening for people of all the ages of all backgrounds right if this is not taken care of it gives a lot of anxiety and this is especially true for people who have demonstrated brilliance demonstrated brilliance in the past because they already know that they can perform well as a result their focus goes to that performance right whether they will do good or not and it creates a lot of worry right i would like to link this also to something what has been said or revealed in the bhagavad gita in which krishna says karm kar phal ki chinta na kar right that is perform the action don't worry about the results as simple and obvious as it seems it's probably the hardest thing to do and i'm going to give you a solution for this i'm going to share you what solution i applied and how it worked for me and you can try it for yourself but there will be a catch if instead of applying the solution if you worry about whether the solution will work or not it won't because because then it's not doing the karma right it's about the worry so if you have want a solution you want something to be executed you have to perform the cause only when you provide the cause will the results come but generally our mind gets stuck in the duality between whether the results will come or they won't come and whenever there is a kind of a split like that we always face pain okay uh, probably i can share that in some other video later on so let's just come back to this that what what can one do when one is feeling anxious because of the results right we all know that we should focus on the cause doing the things but how do we actually do it right how do we forget the the consequences right because for that's what we are going to that's for what we are going to perform the action right if we forget the consequence why will we perform so i call it the step back to step forward technique which i applied myself okay so whenever you have a result in mind think of the cause of it right for example in my case i understood that i am feeling anxious about giving the reiki attunement because probably i am not confident about my understanding of reiki at least in the present moment right so how can i get the confidence there are a lot of visualization techniques and all which work for this but that's for breaking the belief right that you can do it so i had that belief but i had a pain also so i had to work on the cause and the cause for the confidence is basically comes from certainty 
and the certainty comes from knowledge so probably I am anxious right now because I am not certain about my knowledge so what's the solution the solution is probably I should read a lot of books of Reiki Reiki mastership right energy healings I should do that so I decided okay well uh, let me just google up okay I have already read a lot of books but during the time of performance this happens right mind goes into that state so I thought okay let me just open up different kinds of books uh, and videos on Reiki and let me learn I tried I went to different sites okay uh, nothing useful came in except for one site which didn't really help me but gave me the direction which led me to the solution it gave me a way of performing Reiki on myself so that I don't feel the anxiety or restlessness for performing it it seemed a good solution so I decided let me do it okay and when I started doing it like I when I was about to do it I thought I haven't even tried the solution which I already know from my own Reiki practice so why not perform that right so just to be sure I opened the book like looked at the steps and I started working on them okay initially I was in a lot of pain but after three minutes the pain became bearable after another 10 minutes I was smiling okay and I wanted to make this video and by the end of it I got lot of ideas of how I can make a better Reiki class right remember my anxiety was linked to whether I will be able to do justice to the person asking for the Reiki class right of course I can because I have done in the past and I have so many actual testimonials but my mind was caught up in the doubt right the split between whether I can or I cannot and by performing this I was able to do so right so let me share you the secret how you can move away from anxiety about anything and be confident and actually get the results okay so this technique is as I mentioned is step back to step forward technique okay and this is not about Reiki you can apply it to any technique you can do it for your subjects your daily work right if you're a programmer about your coding about your relationships business career anything okay so the pain comes because the mind is lost in the consequences in the dual nature of the consequences right now instead of focusing on the consequences if we can move to the cause of it we will get the answer right and in this case I thought the cause was lack of knowledge right but that was not really the case the actual cause was the lack of action right maybe it was lack of knowledge in the sense I could not remember in my mind what I should do right so as soon as I read up I got the idea I got the instruction and now as we know the the cause of being healed is performance of healing right so before performing the healing on myself I was feeling anxious and that was stopping me from starting the process of healing but as soon as I started the process of healing after some time my mind was engaged in the process of healing and I got the result right so basically I did the karma and I didn't care about the fall right basically I worked on the cause and I didn't uh, care about the results right so whenever you have something which is giving you anxiety the anxiety will be because of the consequences the negative consequences possible so in that case think of what are the reasons which will cause the positive consequences okay and for that you have to study okay this may seem very obvious but you may this is the thing that you may want to remember whenever you are feeling anxious about any action about any performance first go on to the study topic right and actually read up you it may appear to you that you already know stuff but you need to read up stuff 
and that will bring the confidence or the action and the action is what is going to give you the results right in my case the knowledge came i remember the knowledge and i perform the action so let's say if you are going on a date and you're feeling anxious about meeting the person so your anxiety is about that the person may not like you right so here you need to step back and build your knowledge you need to know more about the person probably when you're meeting the person for a date you don't know them enough right or maybe you know them but you have forgotten so maybe you want to go back to the chat and your call logs like not the call logs but the chat and try to see what they say right if they have shared anything about themselves you may want to recall that as well and as soon as you do so you will get certain ideas about what are the things that made you want to meet that person and then you remember that and you keep that as focus and when you go and meet them you just talk about that and it works right similarly let's say you have an exam coming up right and you have not prepared for it and that's why you will be anxious right you will be anxious because you're focused on the consequences fal ki chinta right so at that time there's no way you can really get out of it until and unless you actually take the pain of moving from the consequences to the knowledge right so if you are feeling anxious for your exams you don't know the subject so start studying the subject and once you have identified that you need to study the subject you need to actually perform the action right this is where everyone gets stuck up moving from the consequences to the cause of the subject to the to the cause of action right and this is what i call the step back to step forward and you can perform it for anything that you like okay so i'm going to perform like i am feeling very happy right i got a lot of ideas also to make the class even richer i already uh, look at the testimonials that i got from lot of people so i felt good because my mind got engaged and i performed healing on myself and i felt really good so this is what you should do as well right so try it out let me know if it makes sense you can uh, comment below right and if you would be interested uh, to go for a reiki session or learn reiki or any kind of consultation 